Hello YouTube and welcome to Fractured Space as a brand new series I'm going to be doing. I um, saw this game on Steam and saw a few other people playing it so I thought I'd give it a go. Um, this game is uh, a bit like Dota or League of Legends but kind of in space I think. I'm not really sure. Um, but basically you control one of these command ships and you directly control it so you fly it around, you shoot guns, you aim, you do that kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, I've just started the game and I think the first thing we need to do is register or kind of play a tutorial. So let's kick that off. Right, here we go. standard base of operations. The corporations built it, like everything out here. The forward stations, the mines, even the ships we fly. Your task is to take control of the system. Secure the mines first, then the sectors, and eliminate anyone who gets in the way. And this, this is your ship. The USR Pioneer. It's oh. more than 1,200 meters long and has a crew of over 5,000. That's a lot of responsibility. She a heavy punch. Look after her and she'll look after you. Good luck, Captain. Time to familiarize yourself with the controls of your vessel. Start by right. using Ooh. The mouse alters your view and allows you to aim at targets. Thank you, glowy woman. Right, so you can view your controls and the UI overlay at any time using the O or K keys. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay, case the keyboard. On screen keyboard, right. Right, okay, quiet. AI, strange blue looking woman. So how do I do this? Okay, so you just fly using the WASD keys. Ooh, there's quite a bit of, like, delay. Which, considering how big this ship is, is probably quite appropriate. I can zoom out as well. So... Left click shoots. Ooh. Right click fires whatever that rockety thing was. Oh, was that the... Oh, gravity nuke. I'm not quite sure what that does, but it sounds fun. Um, so yeah, I need to hold the shift key and select destination with your left mouse button. Alpha sector. Uh, go there, please. That's cool. Am I doing a jump? Or... Oh, it's kind of like an FTL jump thing. Destroy the enemy vessel. I could do that. Hey, I got him with the nuke thingy. Does targeting different bits give you more damage? Yeah, eat gravity nuke. This seems fairly simple. Left click, left click to kill. These guys take a hell of a punch, though. So if I target his like engines, do I do more damage? No, I just miss. Hey, the ginger gladiator. <laughs> Indicate distinction. Ah, flashing thing. As well as jump access to the team's base. Head to the flashing mining station. That one. Okay. Right. 
I'm just going to pause for a second and check all the audio and all that good stuff. Cool, all sounds absolutely fine to me. Let's go to the flashing thingy. So is this, um, is this another base? So if I look around here, so that's my base. It's got like a big shield in front of it. Oh, a little bit like that. And there's like asteroids and stuff. There's target buoy. Okay, I'm not sure it'll tell us what to do later. So this is, is this a mining base or is this one of those operating base things? It's probably going to tell us as soon as I go in the orb thingy here. Okie dokie. So do I just, I just have to sit here? Cool. It's fairly simple. Can I go down? Let me use the nuke thingy. Did nothing. Oh, okay. So control points me down, space points me up. Makes sense. Cool. Let's try that one. This is actually fairly, um, fairly intuitive to control. Actually, a bit like one of the subs of um, uh, Subnautica. Pew pew pew. On minimap? You can see it flashing now. Capture the third mine, right. We can do that. Uh, what was it? Control, there we go. It's very smooth the controls. It's pretty it's quite pretty as well. Die target buoy. Oh thanks. Right, so capturing another mine. So it says we get resources. Ooh, don't crash, don't crash! Oh, that was close. Oh, it wasn't that close. Oh, where's that? Where? Ah, I can't see him. Ah. Yeah, gravity mine. When you are targeting an enemy, the icons for the weapons systems that are in range will highlight on your reticule. Ooh, what's two? Oh, missiles! <laughs> Use I don't know what that did then. I want to use my gravity nuke again. Ha! Whoa! Well done. Always prioritize targets that jump during combat. Oh, the mini map's in the bottom right. Okay. Oh, the assisting. Cool. I'm already there. So I can see in along the top there. Um, what's the key? Was it O? Yeah. So your team's level, your current upgrade level. Oh, resources. Oh, thanks. Capturing the enemy forward station usually opens up jump access to the enemy base. In this simulation, we will head to Gamma instead. Prepare to capture Gamma facility when it becomes active. You need to prevent the enemy capturing Gamma. Okay, how do we jump again? You must use your Five. Uh, let's go there. Oh, I did use in five, but it, it works as well. The gamma facility is now active. 
Where is it? Ah, there it is. Cool. This is pretty fast paced, actually. Fire everything! Use this here. Use this thingy to protect myself a little bit. See if I can get around the back of him, and then fire the missiles. Gotcha. So yes, as I was trying to say earlier, it looks like resources is top left, so you can see it going up. That's from the mines we're capturing. Uh, we can upgrade our station, but I've got no idea how we do that. I'm not too sure what the percentages mean. Um, the thing in the middle looks like it's telling us how much we're capturing of the sector. So we're in Gamma at the moment. We can see we're capturing it. And then you've got enemy level, enemy resources. Oh, you can see the enemy resources. That's interesting. Ooh. 100% capture rate. Yes, but there's no way of repairing here unless you have a protector. Where's that protector guy? Warning. An enemy is capturing our forward station. Check the minimap. Oh, okay. Um, what was it? Shift. Let's go there. Hold the shift key and select your destination with the left mouse button. Oh, so if you're playing this, um, if you're playing this online with people, then I guess you'd kind of have to spread out and use comms to. Point defense. Okay. Uh, point defense. Toggle on. Why would you ever have it off? Oh no! Oh, I'm gonna crash! No! Oh, 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 that was close. Point defense! Yeah! Oh, I see, so it activates for a short period of time. So you can't just keep it on permanently. Dum, 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 dum. Dead. Ooh, target baby. Your boy. Depends where, you, where you're from. Uh, what was that? Oh, bugger. <laughs> a big utility. Good. Try to push forward and capture their forward station while the enemy is respawning. Capture the station and you can jump to their base. You can detect enemies hiding in distant parts of the sector using the Pioneer's Reveal Sector ability. Press I see you. Now. Cool, got this mine. Uh, that's, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to see. No, control, there we go. Oh! Ah! I'm gonna hide behind this base, I think. Oh, he got me! So can I, like, silhouette myself behind here? Yes, I can. I'm hoping these mines can't be destroyed. Let's be sneaky-like. Let's go from cover to cover. Hmm. Can I target him? Can I fire rockets at him or something? Doesn't look like that's getting anywhere near him, actually. Ooh. 
Oh, the rockets work. Okay, rockets long range. So I can use his own shield to protect me there. Oh, no, I can't. Fire everything. Oh, point defense. Oh, damn it. It's too, too slow. Oh, I've got me. Got the base. Cool. Let's get him. Cool. Okay, I'm going to repair first, but yes. Okay, uh, what was it? Shift and then. Mm, let's go there. Yes, Coda. Oh, there's a lot of people here. Okay, fire the missiles! Well, I'm guessing it probably helps. Ooh, turret generator. Kill. Right, so let's get rid of these dudes. Oh, no, control. There we go. Let's get rid of these turrets for our allies. Cool, right. Uh, let's go back to try and killing this guy. Oh, he's healing. Oh, uh, point defense, point defense. Hey, there we go. It's quite intense, actually. I'm probably doing a terrible job of this, but I just want to kill him. Oh, no! <laughs> I was not paying attention, was I? Ah, okay. So was I meant to die? Or was I just being terrible? Ah, thank you, Protector Dude. Um, so how do we actually take this thing again? Um, so you don't need... you need to take down... stuff. I want to take down this guy, actually, because I, I feel like he's healing the base. Boom! I'm thinking maybe my allies help me there. <laughs> Ooh, pretty explosions. Cool, so so far this game is incredibly pretty. Continue! Yeah, this game is getting really pretty, especially for a free-to-play game. This is awesome. I wonder how they make their money. Is it for, uh, like, um, a bit like what League of Legends does, where you, you buy skins and you buy new characters and stuff like that? Or... I haven't seen any advertising, so yeah, that must be it. Ooh, monies! I feel like saluting right now. Promoted to cap Captain? Isn't that... That's usually quite a high rank. Should I start at like a rookie or something? We have provided you with a credits booster. Ooh. Please use it now. Booster. Close the results window now. 
precious space. Okay, so I'm going to end this episode here. I'm going to sign up and register and all that good stuff. And then I'll join you in the next episode where we will try and play another game. Thanks for watching and see you later.